Good morning, this is Margie Hare and I want to share with you one of my passions and that is working with spinal health and spinal correction. This little very short routine is three exercises. You do each one for five minutes, so it's 15 minutes. I'm going to show you how to do them, what to do, and you can do it in the comfort of your home. Go to your local sports shop, and this is the A-OK -okay ball. There are other balls. I find the A-OK -okay is the most reliable. I've had this for nearly 20 years. I've even done it outside on the grass, and it's never burst. So you want a burst-proof ball. So. The first exercise is actually sitting on the ball and all we're going to do is balance on the ball and the spine makes tiny little corrections. So all you're doing is balancing on the ball. Doesn't matter how you do it, just balancing on the ball. You spend five minutes just balancing on the ball. Allow the ball to go wherever it wants to go, but make sure you don't fall off. Just balance on the ball. Backwards and forwards, side to side circles, whatever, just balancing on the ball. And what actually you'll find is that the work is done as the spine moves around. That is your first exercise. How easy is that? The second exercise, we, so we've actually been working, imagine your vertebra is like this. The second exercise, we're going to go over the ball like that. So it looks like it's really difficult but it's so easy and it's really comfortable. So the second exercise we start, I call it the frog position because it's really important that you always come back to the frog position. So you've got the ball in front of you, you're over the ball and you are actually pushing yourself forward on the ball like this. The object is to first get your balance so you're not falling off the ball. Once you've got your balance, we're going to go up on the ball and down again. And you do that exercise just for five minutes. And it's not how fast you can do it, it's the rhythm with which you do it. And just notice the angle of the spine. The spine comes up and goes down. It comes up and goes down and that is how the spine retains its flexibility which is what we want a lot of older people the trouble happens is when they fall they're so rigid that they break bones when your spine is flexible it doesn't happen so the third exercise is really really simple so we've done one we've done two and now we're going backwards on the ball. So we've actually worked the spine at all three angles. So we're going to walk forward on the ball until our coccyx is resting on the ball. Then we're going to keep walking forward, keep walking forward until we are, the head, neck and shoulders is resting on the ball. And the object of this one is to rock forward and rock back. And you'll find every time you rock forward, the ball tucks in and janky stretches between each vertebra. Rocking forward and rocking back. And here again, you do it for five minutes. So you set your little clock for five minutes. You do five minutes of the balancing, five minutes forward and five minutes back. When you're feeling really comfortable, you take a step closer to the ball and then see what happens. You go even further. The object is to straighten the knees. So as you straighten the knees, it stretches the spine. When you're ready to come down, take your hands down. You never just lift up, you walk back. The accent is on the feet, you walk back on the ball. You keep walking, you don't lift, you just walk back, walk back, walk back into sitting position. 
15 minutes. How easy is that to have a healthy spine for the rest of your life? I hope you enjoyed that little segment. If you enjoy that, please click the like button. And there's more information about the ball practice on my website. And if you would like more information, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Then you won't miss any more healthy tips. Have a fabulous day.